everyone and welcome to our channel project management and control this video tutorial i'm making to demonstrate how we can install power bi on our laptop uh, on our computer having windows 10 or above so this power bi is an amazing tool when we can create amazing and very fast, uh, beautiful report using the power bi so install power bi in our system mm, we can install in several ways number one the best way is that we can install install, uh, install my, uh, this power bi using the microsoft store before this is this uh, microsoft store is applicable for windows 10 or later the advantage of using microsoft store, store is that this power bi is updated uh, monthly on monthly basis so we don't need to go and every month to uh, uh, to install update if you install Power BI using Microsoft Store, it will be automatically uh, update every week, every month. Other option is that we can open uh, Microsoft uh, Microsoft.com and in this website, when we go in the uh, in the marketplace, we can find Power BI. And the Power BI again, we have two options. One option available is for the Microsoft Store, another for, is for the uh, we can go for manual installation. In the manual installation, we need to uh, select the computer configuration. We need to we can select our language. There are several language options like English, German, French, uh, etc. are available. We can select our uh, language. Uh, we can select our com computer configuration or other the third way as the most common is that we can search on google and go for it in all the way we can reach to microsoft store and i always prefer to use uh, to uh, uh, install mega power bi using the microsoft store so before installation we have to make sure that with our system our laptop configuration it should be 32 or 64 nowadays most of our laptops and machines are 64 bit so you have to select 64 bit and, and we should have uh, the ram of more than 8 gb so now let's start in power bi in the system now if you go in the uh, 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 if you go in the store, Microsoft Store. Okay, in the Microsoft Store, you can go. You just go Microsoft Store, and you can just click the desk, uh, Get button. It will get start installation, or you can uh, do it by using the go to Microsoft.com. In the Microsoft.com, just go to Power BI, and once you click Power BI, you can see the Power BI desktop is available. You can get it free from here. It is free, or you just select uh, go on the uh, Google and search it. So let's start downloading. Just it is here. Just click the get button. It will take some time. Just have a wait. It is start downloading. Uh, you can see now that it is downloading now in process. It will take little bit time, so we need to be a little patient. Now you can see that our Power BI is installed now. You can click open button now from here. So to, for the Power BI to be used more sufficiently, we need to be enrolled with the uh, Microsoft. Uh, uh, we have Microsoft account also to ma make all features available and to make a beautiful report from the Power BI. It's uh, uh, very amazing. And we need to go uh, again in some settings. For example, this option and setting. The options and setting, if you go, you just go in option. In the, in the option, you can see here, uh, you can see here we have need some preview features here. Just go for preview features. This is default features already selected. Uh, it's most of the options are selected. For example, if you make the shape, uh, map visual, uh, Spanish language support, uh, question answer, connection to external uh, semantic model, say all options you need to be selected. So you have to uh, uh, check this one. Here you can see that most of the options which uh, already have selected by default. So now you can start making uh, these changes uh, and to make the, if you make any changes in the option button, you need to close this uh, and need to open it again. For example, if you go again, you can find here just in the, uh, in the search, just like Power BI. Sorry, I think the Power BI. Okay, Power BI apps is available now. It will 
may we need to restore our system so that it will be installed uh, the shortcut will be installed on our system so you can select a blank uh, report from here and once you start report you can see amazing features here we just need to connect our uh, if you are a planning engineer or a planning background and you are using primera we just need to click our uh, data from the primera to power bi and my next video will be to how we we'll, uh, how we we'll connect our primera data for the resources and the cost into power bi to make our amazing and beautiful report so thank you very much uh, very much for your time and if you like it please share, share and consider subscribing me and see you in the next video for the most beautiful uh, for how to how to make it uh, good and beautiful report in the power bi thank you very much again see you take care bye bye